Yes guys, what's going on? Lee Jones here from Jones One On Football Training. I'm back. It's been a long time. I know I've been posting videos here and there, but I've been very busy in the last couple of weeks with the most important one. I've become a dad. That's right, I've become a dad to my amazing little angel, Mia. The best feeling I've ever experienced. Now she's settled in and I'm back to the YouTube channel, back to coaching, and I'm really excited, so let's go. I know why you've clicked on this video, because of the title. Before I go into this video, which is unbelievable by the way, I just want to remind you guys, I'm miles behind in my editing of the videos. I've still got California part four and part five. If you haven't seen part one, two, and three, Look at our videos on our, on our channel. Be sure to look at that, really, really good. I also want to remind you guys, we've got a Sydney Elite Camp coming up in October, a Melbourne Elite Camp and position specific training in September, Miami in December. Yes, guys, you heard it here first. We're going to Miami in December. Details are not on the website yet. However, we're very close to getting that all finalized and California, April 2020 is still happening. You can pre-book with John on our football training with us and the boys on our website. All the links are in the description. Now, as for this video, as you can see by the title, the difference between an amateur player and a professional player. Last couple of weeks in Melbourne coaching for Nike football, which is where I am right now, I've been blessed to work with some top professional footballers at the Elite Football Centre in Melbourne, one of them being Sebastian Pasquale. Um, Sebastian played for Ajax last year, and after speaking to him, I believe that he was in the youth system, but also was training with the first team. As you know, Ajax made the Champions League semi-final last year. This is one of the highest levels that you can play at. During this session, and it was the first session I did with Sebastian, it absolutely blew me away. Technically, he is outstanding. So this is my first training session with Sebastian, and I'll be honest, he absolutely blew me away with his technical ability. Normally when I do these training sessions, straight away I can find out what their strong foot is, and Sebastian just rattled me. I couldn't work out if he was left foot or right foot. And as you can see by the title of this video, this video for me does that justice. Everything that he does is crisp, it's clean, it's tidy, technically good with both feet. He makes it look really easy. He makes the drills look boring. Um, and that for me is the difference between an amateur and a pro. Professionals do the basics a lot more consistently. And I'm really looking forward to doing more sessions with Sebastian because I feel like I need to challenge him a little bit more because he literally was doing every single drill with ease. Obviously, there is more factors in terms of what is the difference between an amateur and a professional, but in terms of what I do, which is individual private training or small groups, he did every drill with ease and it's about becoming technically perfect. So without further ado, guys, I'm gonna let you watch the video. Anyone that knows football will appreciate the high level of technique that I'm about to show you. Hope you enjoy the video. Make sure you smash the hell out of that subscribe button. We're closing in on 100,000. That would be absolutely amazing if we can hit that mark. Enjoy the video. Red, yellow, like it. red, black, stop, orange, to stop yellow, the ball. Red, don't stop, what? don't stop, red, don't stop. Yeah, orange. well done. Just a couple of times you're pausing it. Yeah, sharp in Great feet. Go! Big of eight, come on. Low position. Sharp, sharp. Come on, up, up. Go! Yeah, play! Good sharp, you know, sharp. Yo! Very sharp. Good Ethan, good start, son. Play! Figure of eight, come on. Low position. All the way up. Orange. Turn, keep it tight. Eyes up. Yeah, good feet, you know, low position, I like it. All the way up. Good. Yellow, can we drop the other way? Yeah, good, love it. Great technique, fire. Class, Sam. Yellow. Good touch. Great improvisation. Fire this. Good touch. Play. Figure it out. Keep it tight in here. 
Good, Seb. Eyes forward. Fire. Check your shoulder. Orange. Good. Tighten in. Good. Fire. Play, Ethan. Here's the play. Figure of eight and in. Good. Come on, Shaft. Great feet. Eyes up. Come on. Yellow. Yellow. Tight. Good. Eyes forward. Yes. Great feet. No. Keep it tight in here. Great feet. Great feet. Eyes up. Orange. Drop and go. Love it. Zip. Every time you get to the end of the three discs, we've got to open up our body position and see what's behind us. Okay? Start the drill off. You can start either side. You can check out to win. You're going to pass between every gap. As we get to the end, open up to win another one at the So it could be 12. You then, yep, you're then going to open out, play against the wall, turn, play, and then we check again. Work, up, work our way across the other side. So we play every gap. There we go, open out, 18, set, play, set, play, come into the middle, go again. Shoulders, 17, two, play. So with the, we're going to work on the, um, it's touch, stop and go, so check the shoulder. And here I want you to work on the stop and go with the right foot, you see how it's all one movement. And then on this side we're going to work on the stop and go with the left foot. So you play with your left foot. Good, play. Set. Good. Finish. Oh, come on. 